And in this little tutorial I will show you how to use my Adobe Premiere Project File Converter. So you can use your newest Premiere, which I'm loading right now. This is release 2017. Release 2017 and I have my project here. A little test project which I edited and make my editing ready and now I need a grading, color grading and now I want to grade uh, my project in speed grade but this is not possible with uh, Premiere CC 2017 version but my little converter makes it possible so I save the project close the project file the, close the project in Premiere but leave Premiere open. No. I just lay it down. Now I start the uh, project converter tool, load my project, press convert. Now it is converted to the version 2015.2. This is the latest and uh, the latest version of SpeedGrid available by Adobe. Every time I press convert or reload and convert uh, the project file is being backup in a backup directory in the same folder where the, the project file is located. Uh, down here you see a little uh, lock uh, window where you can see what's going on while converting the file, the project file. Now you can, for a better workflow, you can just leave uh, the converter tool open you notice that the button, the convert button, changed to reload and convert, and we use it later. So we just leave it open, start speed grade. This is the speed grade version, the latest speed grade version available by Adobe. We open our project file, we just convert it. You see it has the same name as your original uh, CC2017 uh, project. The projects, the, the old project files are located in this folder. Nothing is lost, it's just copied into a backup folder. So you open your project file and your uh, Premiere Pro CC2017 project opens just fine after converting it with my tool in speed grades 2015 speed grade 2015.2 so now I can just make my color grading as you would normally grade your your uh, project with all the neat little features which are available in speed grade so just a quick grade so bring out colors a little bit and saturation so okay this looks nice so now I have my graded sequence. I just hit save via this save button here or hit control S. And now I close the project in speed grade with the close project button here. Play speed grade down and with the converter still open hit reload and convert and it reloads as the button says reloads the project we just created and saved in speed grade reloads the project converts it to version 2017 and saves it you can leave the converter still open switch over to premiere load the project in Premiere and the clips are created. 
Uh, now uh, I can re-edit, uh, make my changes, um, need to insert maybe some some clips. Uh, okay, I like this one, I want to insert this clip here without any purpose. Uh, okay, it's not graded. Okay, just hit Ctrl S or on Mac, uh, Apple S. Um, close, close um, your project, leave Premiere open, just lay it down, your converter is still in the background, hit again, reload and convert, the project is converted, uh, bring up speed grade, again load your project and the new scene is here, the new, the new clip is here. Um, you just grade it how you wanted it to look, or just use quick, uh, quick uh, uh, presets. I don't know. Oh, I want to make my own grading. Give it a little more saturation. Yeah, this looks nice. A little more contrast. Mid downs. Okay. I have my popping colors. Once again, hit Ctrl S to save the project. Again, close the project. Place speed right down. With the converter still open, hit reload and convert. Bring uh, Premiere up, load the project. And I have my created inserted clip here. And you have all the benefits of speed grade with the latest version of Premiere. That's it for the basic usage of the Premiere Project File Converter tool. Thanks for watching and have fun with the Project Converter.